there's nothing scarier than seeing something terrifying happen in your own home. What's even worse is when you get it on camera. <laughs> Today I'm going to be showing you unexplainable paranormal videos from around the web. Some so scary they have been banned in other countries. But before I show you anything, I'm going to need you to smash that like button. That way I can tell the ghost in this video not to haunt your dreams forever. Okay, so this came from an Instagram reel. And this person is like, what the hell? Like, there's something standing on top of the bed by my daughter. What the hell is that? You can see its legs. And watch what happens when he gets close to it. I've never seen anything like this. Look at this. Dude, how does that happen? What the heck? He wakes up oh, his daughter dude. and like, yo, we get in the f out of dodge. That's like poltergeist. I'm getting the hell out of that house. Uh uh. Never dude. again am I sleeping in that room or letting my kids sleep in that room. I'm trying to debunk this too. It's like, how would they pull this off if it wasn't real? Like, I mean, I don't see any cuts at all. There's clearly like someone there. Like. Let us know. I mean, is there a way you guys can think that they could have done that? Because I can't think of anything either. So this group of explorers were getting ready to go to explore a haunted asylum. I don't know exactly which one it was. Mm -hmm. And on their way there, check out what they saw. I'm already scared. So they're going down the street. It's dark as hell. And the guy starts beeping his horn. He's like, Whoa, what, what the that? hell is that, bro? Did you see that? Was that like a woman in a white dress? I don't know what it was. It was almost like somebody who had a death wish if it wasn't a ghost. I, I mean, it's just all white. You can't really make out what it is. It's so blurry and it's it's a shame that it is. I, I'd almost want, want to see that in slow motion and blow it up there. Bro, isn't that freaking, that's so scary. I don't, I really, I don't think that's a real person. Oh man. I don't know, what do you guys think? If it is, they're incredibly dumb. <laughs> yeah to be in the middle of the road when cars are going, I don't know, 60, 70 miles an hour, it looks like. Especially when you can't even see them in the middle of the night. Okay, this next one, I really do not know how the hell this happened, bro. So this guy's walking down the street, and you can see him clearly walking. A car is gonna come by, and boom! boom! He disappears! Wait, what was that light that went flying? I don't know, but he ended up across the street when this car came by. Here, watch it again. I gotta see this again. Look at that. Dude, but what was the flash of light? The flash of light was him. It's almost like, beam me up, Scotty, in Star Trek. I think that's more like Guardian Angel was looking out for him. I mean, did he get hit and then teleported? I mean, bro, I'm I'm trying to wrap my, my mind around how this happened. But you know what? It almost looks like the car doesn't... He went into a light. Yeah, it's like he went into some type of portal and came out the other side. I don't know. Dude, that's freaky. Yeah, look at it again. The light starts right when... The car gets close. It's like he goes into a light. See that? Bam. And then he ends up. It's like a light opened up across the street and teleported him. I hope this guy was okay. Like, I, I'm wondering if that teleportation, if it was some sort of camera glitch. I mean, he could have seriously got injured. That one's crazy. That is crazy. By the way, our video from the Trinidad boys from last time definitely won the clickbait award. Let me know what video that we show today wins that clickbait award. So I had James pick out our last video, which happens to be the scariest one. 100% hands down. I don't believe him. It's so crazy that I almost think maybe it's like from a TV show or a movie, but they said it was real. Yo, that's Look a that. freaking alien or something, bro. I You'll see. I can't You'll wait see, to see, bro. It. Make sure you watch to the end because it's going to be worth it. According to James. It will be. I, I, I stayed my reputation on it. I'm not making any promises. I do love sharing videos that people have not seen yet. So if you have something that you want to share with us, please email it. That's how we get a lot of these videos. This video somebody shared with us and it's pretty scary. James has not seen it yet. I have. So it says in Spanish, something here does not want us here and wants us to leave. And you can see a soccer ball. You see it? Whoa. It got kicked, bro. It's, bro, it's getting like kicked a, around. An invisible ghost just kicked the ball. It's like rolling and all of a sudden it... What? I could explain the ball rolling. Right. I cannot explain the ball being kicked like that. How can you even do that? I've never seen anything like that. I've seen balls rolling, but I've never seen anything go like that. And then no. it just violently gets kicked. I would love to see some more of their video footage that they've captured in their house. Because there's something angry there. 
that does not want them there, clearly. You let me know in the comments, what would you do? You seen a ball rolling in your house? First of all, if I seen a ball just rolling in my house, I'd be pretty freaked out. But this ghost took it a step further. He kicked the damn ball, bro. God. Look at that. I have never seen anything like that in my life, and I've seen a lot. Supposedly, this is from that same house. Really? Remember I was telling you that I would love to see another video from We're that house? We're gonna get to see one. This guy gets a knock on his door. He grabs his camera, and you can hear the knock again. Watch really closely what happens. <laughs> Looks down the hall, there's nothing there. It was like a little kid. Did you see a little kid? What the hell? He's scared. Oh, he's definitely afraid. Look, look at that. I almost want to slow that. I want to slow yeah, that down, you gotta bro. Slow that down and and take a look at that. So he opens the door. <gasps> bro, it looks like a little baby or something. That is absolutely insane. It just disappears into thin air. No kid can move that fast. Bro. I give this guy a lot of credit because he went and looked. I, I would have, if as soon as I saw that, I would have been out of there. You know what I think? Huh. I think we need to go there and do an investigation. So this ends abruptly at the very end. I almost want to pause and slow that last part down a little bit and see if we see anything. Let me know if you see anything out of place here. Okay, so this lady is in her living room showing her dogs and she's just probably doing like a Snapchat or something. Chill night, chill night. Dogs even chill, but look at the dog. It looks in, and even the lady noticed. She's like, what the hell is that? Did you see that? And there was like a shadow in the hallway. Play attention to up here. Like it takes you a second to look at it. So the dog sees it too. It's right up here. Watch. Oh. Bro, is it that yeah. freaky? The fact that the dog saw it too. Was like the dog insane. reacted to yeah. it, man. Like that the dog is, was like, what the heck? That's terrifying. Could you sleep easily that night if you're that lady? <laughs> I'll tell you what. So there was this night where my dog Luna started barking into a dark closet right. and it was at three o'clock in the morning. Remember when we first started getting into videos was, like this? I remember this night. I remember, I remember seeing the footage from this. It was terrifying. I could not go to sleep. Now, if I saw something like this, in my closet, right. mm -hmm. I would have packed my bags and left my house. I think it was something you brought home with you. Oh yeah, 100%. no, for sure. And that did happen a few times. It's really important that when you're doing like some ghost hunting, definitely have the live function on because you can catch a lot. So there's a family photo going on here. And when somebody, whoever owns this photo clicked on it, pay attention to what's over here in the corner. This is just a photo, but in the live photo feature sheet, you could tap on it and you can see like, you know, it's like a little quick video. Watch when they slow it down. Whoa. What the hell is that, bro? It's it like looks a spirit running for the hills. Bro, that looks like a demon with four legs. Like yeah. that is terrifying. It had to be moving pretty quick considering it was a live photo. That is crazy. You know what I think it was? Uh, I think they knew they were taking a picture and it was like, I'm gonna get out of the way. So uh, it took off. You know how some haunted locations they'll share like live photos right. where you'll see like dark shadow figures? It's really cool to go through your live photos at a haunted place and check to see if you have any anomalies like this because it's quite popular. such a good idea, never thought of that. I'm gonna yeah, try bro. that from now on. I don't know if that's luck or if that's just absolutely terrifying. I don't know, I think it's pretty terrifying. Like was one of these kids playing the Ouija board or something? Maybe so. Or maybe they were watching the fam or Omar Gosh TV videos. So we all love Stranger Things. I don't know, have you watched Stranger yeah. Things? Yeah. This guy goes in his bathroom and sees something weird. It's only a couple seconds long, but like, what it's the hell disgusting. is that? Whoa. You see that, bro? It's like a tail of some sort goes into the drain and it, it, there's all this like black stuff all over the sink too. Like, I don't know, can you describe that? I don't know, but who would you, would you call a plumber for that? <laughs> would you call an exorcist? <laughs> I don't know. The plumber priest. The plumber they priest have to exist go. out there. Yeah, but they do, right? I know you can't see very well, but- <laughs> Understatement. You, you really have to, probably watch this a couple times to, to see it. They whip out their camera and they see that their baby is looking at something and they're smiling, the baby's smiling. And I've seen this before when it comes to spirit activity. But if you look closely, and I'm just gonna show you where to look, look at the vent up here, you're gonna see a hand and the, the baby's pointing at it. Look, there's a freaking hand coming out of the vent. Ah, I give that the clickbait award. <laughs> Now, before we get into the rest of the video, I had to share with you this fragrance subscription-based service, also known as Scentbird. Scentbird is your fragrance destination to discover all sorts of fragrances, whether you like sweet ones, unisex ones, masculine ones. This is well thought of. You can see here, you just unlock it right there. 
you can spray it. This is called Sugarful by Michael Germain. I don't know if I said that correct. This happens to be my brand new favorite fragrance. Just the other day, I was smelling bad. I just came back from the gym. My girl invited me to go on a date with her and I'm like, oh my God, I need to smell better, okay? I grabbed some of this, sprayed a couple sprays. When we sit down at this restaurant, the waitress comes over, starts complimenting me on how great I smell. True story, it's a sweet, intoxicating lavender smell. It is beautiful. Remember I was telling you all the Scentbird unisex options? This is another one right here, also known as Scents of Wood. Woo! Kinda has a magnolia, jasmine type smell. This one's called The Maker Libertine, and it has more of a fruity type smell to it. And this is also a unisex option. Make sure to use my coupon code to receive 55% off. There's also a link in my description that you can click that would send you directly to Scentbird. And that's just a little over $7 for your very first month. This is available to the US and Canada. Big special thanks to Scentbird for sponsoring today's video. When you show them support, you're showing me support. And for that, I thank you. Let's get back into the video. I never seen anything like this, but on a movie. This girl's talking to her friend and she's laughing. I mean, I, I, you know what? This has probably happened to you before. I, have you ever like gotten a joke and, and like it was so funny to you that you just like froze? I've never froze after a joke, but I've definitely almost peed myself. Sorry, I was froze. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, this girl legit freezes like some Matrix stuff. Like, check okay. this out. So she's talking to her friend, and then watch this. Oh, that's creepy. That's creepy, bro. I'd be like, hello. She's like, yo, what's going on? And then she just snaps out of it, just like that. Maybe she was like in deep thought or something. Nah, bro, that, she almost looks like robotic, bro. <laughs> she does, maybe she is a robot. Dude, like she just, it's so weird how she froze like that. Have you ever heard of that happening to someone like that? I don't know if I've ever quite experienced anything like that. It's pretty freaky. Yeah, that's weird. I'm curious what they're actually saying. If anybody knows in the comments that speaks the language, let us know what they're saying. I'm really curious. <laughs> Let us in on the joke, you know? Drink up. Drink up. Drink up. I think that I think that was her name. You know our friend Vicky Colleen? Yes. Well, she shared this with me and it's definitely worth you watching. She might have shared it with you too, but maybe you missed it. That could definitely be. So her coworker is coming down the hall and she's hiding with the camera. You know, you do this all the time to me, bro. Mm -hmm. I mean, you did it just a minute ago on Instagram. So she's standing with her phone filming and she knows that her coworker is walking by, bro. Watch. This is literally, this is like the funniest thing ever. So <laughs> <laughs> what did she oh, do? Oh, oh, watch. <laughs> 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 That's not Vicky's coworker. I can no. just tell you right now, though. Bro, look at like I froze it. Look what she she, <laughs> she kind of stood there for a minute, and it looked like she peed herself or so because she just couldn't she contain herself. <laughs> uh, I, I think that's more like some hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, uh. hilarious! Big shout out to our friend Vicky Colleen for sharing that with us. Okay, you know how I used to have a Tesla, right? Yes. The Tesla will sometimes pick up like a garbage can or like a cone on the side of the road. It picks up a lot of things, people, mm -hmm. a motorcycle. Well, from time to time, people would show up that weren't really there. Mm. There's nobody there. Let's see, I could get the camera. <laughs> what? what the hell? What's going on here? Oh. And I have seen some videos online of people going through cemeteries and seeing people. That's starting to become popular, actually. Really scary, really scary stuff. So you can see on the radar, it shows the dog walking by. Mm -hmm. But look, there's a person there, and then it disappears. And then it even showed a car for a second, almost like a phantom car. But but look, bro, it's showing a person there. See that? And there's nobody the there. This way. Maybe it's just having an error. Look, and it's right? gonna. There is a cat that's walking by, and look, it shows it on the radar. But there is no person there. 
that's pretty freaky. Now I caught the same thing, but it was on the back side of my car and it was like touching my car. Mm. It was pretty freaky. All Souls Day, Dia de los Muertos. Mm. Day of the Dead? Day of the Dead, that's what she's saying. So, James with his Spanish. Like it even shows the car or the van across the street. Right. So I mean, it goes to show you how smart this radar thing is. Do you think that Tesla could be onto something when it comes to, you know, their oh, radar yeah. picking up like ghostly activity? Yeah, because I mean, that's not something that happens normally, but I've seen more and more people be able to like catch things like that in cemeteries. Bro, this next one, I watched this and I still can't wrap my mind on how it happened. Well, this is a basketball game, Warriors against the Hawks. I don't watch a lot of basketball until like the playoffs, but this would have been awesome to watch on live TV. Watch number 23, okay? He's gonna get the ball, all right? Bam, he gets it, and look at this. Bruh, legit did a Bluetooth pass. How the hell did that guy get the ball? Look, how'd that happen? It's called a bounce pass. Well, bro, you don't, where's the ball though? You can't see it. Look, look again. It, <laughs> no, nah, look, look. How the hell did that, bro? You cannot see the ball. Why are you effing with me, bro? Why are you effing with me? Because I've seen the same exact clip, bro. You've seen this clip before? Yes, and I started thinking the same thing. I watched over like 10 times and I'm figuring how Dude. this is possible until I seen another angle of this and saw the comments where somebody said, it's called a bounce pass. And you can clearly see in the other angle, he bounced past it, but you don't see the ball being bounced because the body blocks it. Bro, there's <laughs> no body blocking this. The look, I'll tell you, right? Okay, here. He's gonna bounce pass it right now. He does it just like this in front of his body. You don't see it because his body blocks it and the other guy blocks it. So but it's like an optical illusion. It's an optical illusion, okay. yes. But you are right. It is very hard to explain. Like, it's a no-look pass. And I wouldn't have understood it either until I seen somebody else post that and okay. then posted a second angle of it. But you're right. That, that was funny, bro. I'm sure a That's lot of you I've seen probably it. seen this clip too. I mean, <laughs> we may post some stuff here and there that you've already seen, but We've never seen it. It's new to us. Might be new to some of y'all. Mm -hmm. Little girl's crying. Yeah. Took me a second to see this. Look, there's a rocking chair. I think that's what it is. Oh, yeah. Moving. Yeah, a guy sees it in his baby monitor. I mean, you can clearly see that his baby's terrified. Oh, I mean, wow. She's crying as soon as she, like, sees her dad, she's crying. Look at that. Dang. Bruh. That's terrifying. Sure is. All right, this next clip, it's not really ghostly, but it's definitely creepy AF. Okay. And it goes to show you that you cannot believe everything that you see on TV. She points out that she's watching a TV show where it shows a crowd, mm. and she's seeing the same people in the crowd, mm. like more than one person. So mm. check this out. Pay attention to this lady. She's right there. Mm -hmm. And then look, the same lady's right there. I mean, does she have an identical twin? I think not. So she mm -hmm. shows that guy. Yeah, and then he's there too. It was like cardboard cutouts. And then look at this woman here. She's right there and not far away. I mean, look, it's the same exact woman. Like, what the hell is this? Are they cardboard cutouts? Nah. This is supposed to be a TV show showing people as an audience. Maybe they just didn't have enough audience members and they had to create some. I don't know. If it was a video and they're all moving, then I would say- No, honey, they are. Some of these people are moving. I, that's some Matrix kind of stuff, honestly. I don't know. Because she paused it to show the, the people. Then that's really strange. Wow. Oh, that's pretty creepy, bro. Let us know what you guys think. I'm curious. So you know how like, people do like TikTok dances and stuff like this couple's doing a TikTok dance mm -hmm. and pay attention to the background so this is like a popular like dance that a lot of people do and they start doing it and as they're doing it look in the background the wife sees it and she's like yo what the hell what's going on the husband's like yeah that's freaking weird. Did you see it? No, I missed it. So look at the paper towel holder in the background. Okay, pay attention to that. So they're doing their dance. Look, it's moving in the background. <laughs> ah! ah, what the hell? <laughs> Come on, man. Okay. Wait, did you have slobber on your hand or something? No, I, uh, that was no. just probably sweat from your neck. Uh, 
That was scarier than this video. Maybe they're dancing so much that they were causing the wind to make it move? Nah, because it keeps moving. And then the dude picks it up to show that, you know, there's no magnet of some sort making it move. Like, how the hell was that moving in the background like that? I mean, if it wasn't paranormal, of course. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you can oh, see that. Oh, yeah, the whole paper towel roll moves. What the hell? Judging by the look on her face, she's freaked out. I mean, she's not even in the picture anymore. That is really strange because, like, he shows the bottom. There's nothing there. Can't explain that one. I can't play the music here, but it's that jiggle jiggle song. Like, jiggle jiggle. It's like kind of robotic and stuff. You want to do it in TikTok dance? Nah. This one is really effing scary, bro. Like, real scary. Not as scary as the last one. No, no. We're still saving the best for last, okay? You let me know what you see, okay? okay. So this girl's in the garage doing something, but watch what happens. She gets yanked by her foot, and something is pulling her. And then she gets up and then oh, runs off. Out. Like, what the hell is that? I mean, we've seen clips like this before where it showed like a dark figure or something. You can't see nothing in she's this. She's running as if she is absolutely terrified. And I would be too. Oh my God. Like, what would you do if something like that ever happened to you? Like, I mean, how would you even explain that to somebody? I don't know. You capture it on video and share it with the world. It's a, that's what you do. That's right. But it's a good thing she escaped, man. It's kind of, you know, pull her into the depths of hell or something. I don't oh know. Oh, my like, gosh. That is, that is terrifying. Yeah, like the death angel was there to pay her a visit. But then he was like, you know what? I'm going to let you go. You've been a good girl today. You know how Google has those cars that go down the road and do like the Google images? Mm-hmm. Uh, not Google Images, but they do the Google Map. Right. You know, sometimes when we find like a really cool abandoned place, mm -hmm. we'll go to the little Google 360 camera. Yep. Now there's people out there that exist that really have nothing better to do but search Google Maps and see these weird anomalies that happen. And it's cool for entertaining purposes like I'm going to show you right now. And plus it's scary. So watch what happens, okay? This is a Google 360 and it shows a rabbit right there, right? Mm -hmm. He goes a little bit forward. The rabbit's gone, all right? Look at it. Like, what the hell? It was in the sky. So it's on the ground right there. Watch. It goes forward, turns around, rabbit's gone. But it's in the freaking sky. I know what it is. What? It's Air Jordan. Get it? <laughs> hey, Air Jordan? <laughs> Air Jordan, bro. That's good. Yeah, I like that. That. <laughs> that is a good dad joke. Air Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, like, how did that end up in the sky like that? Oh, no. I mean, I know rabbits could jump, but can they jump that high? No. Did he get run over by the car and then Nuts. did, like, a, a Hair Jordan move? No, maybe that's possible, but poor rabbit. It, it definitely looks like it's jumping, though. Yeah, that's kind of creepy. All right, this next clip is probably one of my favorites because of how scary it is. Oh, boy. Now, there's a lot of crazy stuff that happens within this house. I have seen a few videos in this particular household, but I've never seen this clip. So he's just chilling. You can see a ball rolling behind him. It's basketball. Mm. Yeah, the ghost wants to play. He wants to play with him. Watch what happens next. Couldn't get his attention with the ball. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Kid is running. Ball's rolling. Ghost is like, oh, I can't get your attention that way. How about this, sonny boy? It's like wired headphones, and you probably got repossessed. You something. ain't playing video <laughs> games. You gonna play with me. I guess not. Get some exercise, boy. So, Tiffany, as we were making this video, shared this clip with me. I have not seen it yet. Of course, you haven't seen it yet. He hasn't seen any of these clips. Mm -mm. So, the girls are just chilling on the bed. I want to know why there's a camera in their room like that. Kind of weird, but they're laughing. Maybe they just got security cameras all over their house. Ghost is like, I see you. <laughs> they're laughing. They're having a good time. Yeah. But not on this ghost clock. I don't know what they're laughing about, but they, they ain't going to be laughing in a second. Did you see her hair? Her hair like moves weird okay yeah they weren't laughing about that one i think you just got done playing the ouija board and that's what happens that is terrifying like watch her ponytail again like this is so creepy like she puts her head to the side is laughing and and then all of a sudden it's like look at that wow <laughs>
How does that happen? Oh no, I have seen some videos like this where women's hair are like getting pulled. Look at that. Right. Bro. I remember something like that happened to Tip before. Yeah, and we caught it on video. Yeah. We saved the best for last. I don't know if it's the best, but James is saying that it is. I have not seen it yet. So my reaction to this is gonna be 100% raw. Hashtag James was right in the comments. All right, let's get to this. I hope it's good, because I heard him looking at it oh, earlier. It's good, it will blow your mind away, okay? Okay. Now maybe, I, I just to say, okay, I don't know where this clip came from. Maybe it's from a movie, but it doesn't look like a movie. Maybe like I don't I can't explain it. So. I'm looking at the beginning of it right now and it doesn't look like a movie. <laughs> Alright, so there's obviously a couple cameras. I can see why you think it could have been a movie. Because of the couple couple camera angles. Well no, it, it's about the end part for sure. Okay. I mean, it doesn't look like a movie. Well, it looks Just, like they're doing some sort of ritual. Yeah. Wait till you see. What the fruit cake is that? Bro, I have no idea, but it's gonna get even crazier. Oh my god. Like, keep watching. Cause this is gonna give me nightmares for real. Bro, is this real? Is this is this real? Bro, I don't know. It's so crazy it might not be real. Alright, this is in the pitch black darkness because they're using IR. It gets way crazier. Yo, that's Look a at that. freaking alien or something, bro. Bro, I don't know what that Yo, is. Yo, oh, <laughs> oh my crazy. God. <laughs> it gets crazier than this? Yes, keep watching. Look. What the hell is that with his eyes? Bro, this is clickbait, bro. <laughs> bro, that's terrifying. What are you talking about if that's real? Dude, what the hell is it? It's like his eyes are becoming disconnected. This is terrifying. They're crying. Listen to them. Yeah. They're all screaming and crying. They're all getting like demon possessed or they're passing out or something. But watch that face because it's going to like disappear in a second. Bro, I've never seen anything like that. Okay, so the face is like to the side. Like. Plus that huge, whatever it is, shadow. Oh, it disappeared. Just gone. Well, he's praying, praying it away and he's. I don't know what he's doing. He's like. Doing some karate. <gasps> Did you see that? It went into the guy. Yeah, and the guy's out. Tell me that is not freaking terrifying. That has got to be. Did they not see this thing though? Because it's the it's darkness. Dude, they all look like. I don't know. I don't know. I just that has got to be one of the craziest things. If it's real, that has to be the craziest thing I've probably ever seen. If you have any clips that you want to share with us that are terrifying, it doesn't have to be your clips. It could be someone else's. There's an email link down below in the description. Got to go for now before you leave. Give me a kiss. Peace.